Good morning and welcome. Now, if you can imagine an orangutan, they've got very long arms, haven't they, compared to human arms. Pick the biggest orangutan that's ever lived with the biggest, longest arms, right? Think of that. Mazzy has given me a list bigger than that. It's bigger than any arm in the world. It's massive. A list of jobs. A jobs what I can do in the motorhome. Quite excited about some of them. Terrified about some of the other ones. No, I can't do some of the other, other ones. Uh, and simply dreading most of them. But I'm going to do them. I'm going to film them. Now, you might notice, you might not, we have a new camera set up in front of me. I'm not going to tell you what it all is in this video. That's for another video. Um, but yeah, you should have a smoother ride today instead of as normal uh, jaggedy one over here. Job number one. She thinks this is easy. It's not. She gave me this. Ooh, what's that I said? What's that I said? It's a new sink hole pluggy thingy. Right? Let me show you what the problem is and why she wants it replacing. I, c yeah, I can go along with it. I can understand why she wants it. I just don't understand why she thinks I can do this job. But I'll give it a go. So here is our sink and our sink area. As you can see, it's lovely and clean because I've just cleaned it up. She didn't even clean it up for me. I've cleaned it up. Now, you're going to think this is disgusting, but just bear with me. Yeah? Hear what I've got to say. Um, the problem is that... Now this isn't just muck and grime, that is, these are made out of plastic and look, it just comes off, it's like a a chrome cover and it's just all brittling away and apparently she's cut a finger a few times on this so it all needs to come out and a brand new one putting in that's the plan, that's my job, that's what I've got to attempt to do so, I'm guessing I'm going to have to go underneath the sink to do this job. So I need to take these out, these drawers. That's going to be hard enough on its own. Get the drawers out so I can get underneath and then we'll see what's what. This is what came in the package. I think she said she got it from Brown Hills, you know, the uh, motorhome company. Uh, that's, I don't know, do you call it a trap pipe? That'll go underneath. That is what's actually going in, which I thought we'd need some kind of uh, plumber's putty. But I've just been told that this uh, seal does the job, so we don't. We're not going to need that. So that was in there. Then that will go in there. That I don't know. Does that go in? I don't know. I don't know. No idea now. What's going on here? And yeah, just a little fancy thing, just for sake of it. So there's extra bits. I don't know what they are. I suppose once I get underneath and I take things out, it'll give me a better idea. But let's just go along with what we've got for now. Woo! New sinkhole. Very excited. So far, so good. I managed to get this drawer out. If anyone wants to know how to do this, by the way, you pull the drawer. It gets to so far on this uh, runner. And then on the side of the drawer here... Oh, you've got a little latch, you just lift that up and then it'll slide even further and come straight out. Can you see it there? Just a little latch there. So we've got the drawer out. I've put a bit of lightning there for your comfort. Never really used this torch before but that's handy because it's got a, a magnetic back. So that's good. Um, I've got a bucket underneath. And here we are, this is what we need to replace. I'm going to replace the whole thing. So, I don't know how I'm going to film this, but just leave me to it, let me have a bit of fun, yeah? So I'm really not sure how this works at all, so I'm just going to play around with it. I'm guessing... Okay. Just pull the lead... Pull that pipe straight out, and I'm guessing the same at the other end. Yeah, uh, good job I put that there, isn't it? You see, I'm not stupid. I put a bucket underneath and it's, uh, I did it for a reason and it's worked. Well done, Dan. Now what, does it twist? Oh, it's turning, it's coming off. Nothing has gone wrong yet. This is absolutely fantastic. It's come off. Uh, it's full of gunk. Look at how this, should I be showing you that? Mazzy won't be happy, that's disgusting. But we have been saying to ourselves, you know, for the for the last year, 
We should really get that off and give it a good clean out because it's probably gunky in there. That's off. Good job that one. Now then. Oh, ho -ho, it just pushes straight up and comes out the other end. I'm a genius and I'm, I'm an absolute genius. So coming back to the top. There you are, it's fully out. Look at the state of that. But you can see, look at this chrome, it's just cheap rubbish. And I'll tell you what's annoying. Now I'm not going to blame Brown Hills for this. Um, that's where we got it from. It's just nice they've got the parts that we need. £80 this new system's cost us. £80 just for a new plug hole. But that's Hymer, Hymer Parts for you. Or whoever, I don't know who it's from, but... Uh, you do get ripped off when you need spare parts in a motorhome. Warn you of that one f straight away. Right, let's give this a clean up and then see about getting a new one in. Nothing's going wrong. Just in case there's anyone out there who needs one of these new sink holes. Um, this is the packaging. I don't know if that's the part number. Uh, it's a Dometic. There, that might help you. Comes with instructions, and I am reading them, because I've just made my first, nearly made my first mistake. Uh, you've got a little ring here which needs to come off, because we've got a new replacement one. So I'll shove that from underneath. Come on. In fact, no, I'm just gonna clean that up a bit. So I've cleaned all that, and now, so it's the thick edge goes to the bottom, and I think I just push that up. I'm gonna need two hands. I, I need a camera woman. Where's my camera woman? I'm on my own today. Oh, let's try it from the top. Hey, the things I get asked to do. Okay, it's going in. Not easy with one hand, but it is going in. Come on. There, 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 there. Okay, so we've got a new nice seal. And please make that watertight, because if that doesn't work, I'm in trouble. Sorry, I keep holding you up there, don't I? I need to start looking through my screen more. There, that's in. What's next? Um, something what looks like that. Is that the actual thingy, my bobby? I think it's that bit. I think it's that bit. That goes in there. Does it? That ain't gonna go in there. Does it go in there? Oh, it's a tight fit. That's surely a good thing. Oh, I can hardly push that down. <sighs> yeah, bit of a rim there, I don't know why. Let me just play around with that. I'm just winging it now. I'm starting to lose confidence in myself. This, oh, let's get under here. Um, this thing here just seems to have a couple of little lips on it. One at this side, one at the other. Now, I'm guessing one goes in that hole and just clips in there and one on the other side. But, and that just pushes on. But ideally, I want it facing that way rather than at an angle. So, let me just try and straighten that up a bit and then we'll stick that on. So, I've got my little thingy there. Line it up with this one. I'm guessing it doesn't matter which way around it goes. Push it on. There, it's clipped. It's clipped. It doesn't feel very solidly on, but I'm guessing that's all it needs. I hope that's all it needs. So underneath here, you've got a screw thread. So I'm guessing that goes into the screw thread in the plastic thing to hold that up. So you put that in. This must be a key. Indeed, it fits perfectly. Screw away. If that tightens up now, I'm a genius. I'm an absolute genius. Don't go too tight because it is very flimsy, chromey, plasticky stuff. You don't want to overdo it, otherwise it might snap. But that seems pretty secure now. Have I done it? Is she going to love me or what? So... If that's that, surely that is that, or is it the other way, yep, yeah, that in there, and now, do I just shove them on? This is looking a bit, ooh, 
Oh, hang on, that's got a plastic thing on the end. That one hasn't. Maybe it's... Yeah, it's stuck on there, look. Uh, right, I'm going to have to play around with this, clean this up and take that plastic bit off and stick these on the end of there. I have to be honest, I'm struggling with this, so I've got some pliers. Fingers crossed. I can't. I can't seem to pull this off. Need a better grip, maybe a rubber glove or something. A marigold, that's what I need. Not a pink one, though. So how are you getting on, my lovely? Oh, you've mm. joined me now, it's nearly I have. finished. I have, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just cleaning up these pipes. Let's have a look. There is a lot of gunk in here, but you'd expect it, wouldn't you? Yeah. You know. I am actually surprised at how bad that really was. You think how much Ugh. rubbish goes in there. That's disgusting. Yeah. Mm. Uh, anyway, all I need to do now is try and get this on here. Easy. Just hope that stays on. That should just push on there. Can't see what you're doing. Oh, yeah, yeah, I see. Oh, it's not. So we've got a new trap. Oh. I'm struggling to get them on. Why? Because they came off easily enough. Because they're new, is it? Oh, that's on. Yay! This one isn't, though. Have you shown them the finished product? Look how posh that looks. Oh, I'm so happy. The only worry is there's going to be a leak. I think that's it. I think I've done it. So I just thought we'd show you what we've actually taken yeah. out. This actually... <laughs> that is disgusting. It reminds me of the toilet space. It just shows how much that needed doing. Look at the gunk inside. It was inside. actually blocked on one side. Yeah. It was like an inch thick of something. Yeah. It hasn't been going through very well no. either, has it? And look at this. Look. It's just it's destroyed. horrendous. Destroyed. Yeah. Destroyed. Again, it's just plastic coat. Well, it's just plastic. Ah, look at the state of it. Yeah. It's not muck. That isn't muck. That's just the coating coming off. It's all... Yeah. Battered. So I needed doing. Jobs are good. Would you want to turn it on and just test, see if there's a leak? I'll get under here. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to give it a minute for that to fill up, I think. Yeah. But it is coming through now, Mazzy. You should have some leak by now if you're having one. Zero oh, leak. well, Chuff, baby, you're the best. Are you ready for your next job? Oh, give over. I've just fixed that brilliantly, I might just add. Yeah, you've done amazing. Thank you. I really <laughs> thought that would be quite hard. Um, honestly, guys, if anyone's got the same problem with your chrome coming off, yeah. your tap looks disgusting. They're only plastic, that's the thing, cheap aren't they? Cheap plastic. Chrome well, they're not cheap, cheap, expensive plastic. plastic. I've been telling them <laughs> that they're about £80. Pounds. Yeah, I mean, you can buy just this basket, I think about 30 quid, 35 pounds. For that? Yeah, the, just wow. that, that's plastic. Wow. Or to buy the whole system, which I knew needed replacing because I kept cutting my hands on it for about 80 quid, so... Okay. Well, if, yep, if... let's have a look. Oh, is that leaking? No, don't say that. What are you saying that for? Because that tissue's wet. No, it's dry no? as a bone. Is it? it? Dry as a bone. Stop making me panic <laughs> that's brilliant <laughs> uh, yeah if anyone has that problem and you want to replace it it'll cost you about 80 pounds and it is easy if i can do it anybody can do it so uh still quite a lot of jobs left for me to do i believe yes yes so join <laughs> us for more of these jobs throughout the week because they're gonna be coming thick and fast yep bye bye